Uh, so welcome back guys my name is Ramlan and in today's make much free campaign we go about looking at how we can solve this issue wherein after installing whatsapp you basically don't get to see any contacts on your whatsapp messenger so basically here i have the dual version of whatsapp installed and you can see like if i tap on chats i don't see any contacts here likewise none of the other features obviously updates calls or any other things is reflecting any of my contacts now quite obviously whatsapp like any other android application is also an application which requires permissions and in this case you will require to assign whatsapp the permission to use contacts on your phone that's how basically the contacts which are there in your phone contact book will be used by whatsapp so the way we do this is by like you know heading towards settings inside settings um, head towards apps So once we have apps opened up, just search for WhatsApp. And this is actually the primary version of WhatsApp. I need to search for the dual version of WhatsApp, which I'm using presently. So once I use the dual version of WhatsApp here, you can see the permissions which have been granted. Don't allow for WhatsApp to access my contacts. So I need to tap on this. And then I need to allow for contacts. Now here you can see in the right hand side there's a three little dots and it will tell you like what it uses uh, a certain permission for so if we are talking of contacts here it is using contacts for finding account reading your contacts modify your contacts so all those things can be uh, like used by whatsapp but presently we haven't given whatsapp the permission to access contacts and that's the exact reason why the contacts have been appearing so i simply need to select this and i need to allow this so once I do this, uh, it's quite possible that WhatsApp will still not load. So what I will need to do is I need to simply close it and then reopen this. So I will reopen the app right now. So I basically go ahead and tap on WhatsApp. And now if I see contact list, you will see that this is reflecting all my friends here and all my contact books have come so i can now go ahead and send message to my contact book and everything so this is how you simply uh, import contacts from your contact book into whatsapp and i believe this is very important because when you are installing whatsapp for the first time and you don't get to see any contacts you must be starting to wonder well how am i going to use whatsapp in the first place so go ahead and do this and it's not just with whatsapp it's with any other android application you need to give the application permission to use certain things so if i don't give whatsapp the permission to access calls i can make calls using whatsapp if i don't give whatsapp the permission to use contacts i won't be seeing my contacts so understand this concept and you will be good to go so that's all from my side i hope you had a nice one understanding this tutorial if you liked it please do keep your likes comment subscriptions coming they mean the world to me until next time it's me amlan signing off